In this video, I will show you how you can customize your cookie banners with Secure Privacy. Now, in the case right here, I'm logged into the Secure Privacy Administration dashboard. And in order to change the, the, the text and the looks and feels, first navigate to Banners and then Cookie Banner. From here, you can uh, change the text if that's needed. Perhaps you have a recommendation by either your lawyers or um, copywriters who have input right here. Um, you have to select, if you have multiple language support enabled, you have to select the language in the upper right corner first, and then you can then change the text accordingly right after, okay? Um, you also have um, a different options to uh, of the position of the banner. So you can have in the upper area or in the lower area by default. Then we also have something called um, a simple, but also a detailed cookie banner um, to give you an example how that looks on a website. So in this case right here, uh, that's what we call a simple cookie banner. Okay, very straightforward. Uh, nothing to, um, to uh, question right there, but in the detail right, uh, has a bit more options. So if I press save, let me show you how that looks on the website. What it does is that it basically adds a bit more information to the cookie banner. So you can see what kind of categories of cookies and trackers are, um, uh, are there. But also if you click on details, um, you then provide the visitors with more options to control or change the controls of the trackers being injected on a computer. So that's the difference between the simple and the detailed cookie banner. If you want to completely redesign how the, the cookie banner looks, you can add custom CSS. Um, and we also provide JavaScript methods for you as well right here. Um, if you want to change the, the standard color of not only the cookie banner, but also the privacy center and the trust badge, then you have to go to settings because we provide the same look and feel across all the different types of banners and features on, on the website. So in this case, let's uh, select green, for instance, and press save. Um, and that will then reflect how the different um, banners and widgets look on the website right here. So now it turns green. Um, and also these parts are now changed in the color as well. Okay, so it's it's fairly simple. Um, try it out yourself and, and navigate and see how you uh, how it, it looks best on your website. Thank you.